Hello friends, today we make Arduino interface with Vivo Motorola. Now start the project. First we open Tinkercad. This is the Tinkercad dashboard. First we search Arduino UNO. Then drag and drop here. Another take one breadboard. This is a breadboard. Now we search L293D motor driver IC. Drag and drop here. You can see the output of the IC. You can see there is two VCC pin and two enable pin. And four is the ground pin. Four and five. Three and two is the ground pin. In there is four input. One, two, three, four, and four output. Now we have to connect the circuit like that. Take VO motor. Motor. This is a VO motor and 60 RPM motor. Now connect the circuit. First we connect PCC pin to the Arduino. PCC pin connect to the breadboard. Make red. This means red. And ground pin connect to the breadboard. I have connected the ground pin. This is the ground pin. Now connect the IC and now bypass the voltage and current. VCC and ground. VCC pin connect to the breadboard. And ground pin connect to bypass here. Make the color red. Now connect the IC. First terminal is the enable pin. Connect to the power 5 volt and port 8 terminal is a power pin. Connect to the power and 16 terminal also power pin. Connect to the power and terminal 7, 9 pin also connect to the power. You can see if you connect the enable pin, then 1 and 2 output pin, input and output pin control it, control from Arduino. Now ground pin connected to the ground. These two pin are ground pin. Bypass the ground and connect to the ground. Here also connect the ground pin. Now, now we connect the input pin. You have to use any crystal pin. I have connect second. Input pin connect to the second pin of the IC. And the second digital pin connects to the connects to the seven pin of the IC. This is the seven pin. Now there is two output pin, output one and output two. One pin connects to the motor. Terminal three, 3 pin of the IC and second pin second pin of the motor connect to the terminal 6 pin of the IC. I have connected both pin. Now make the code circuit is completed. Now make the code click on the code section and delete this code and take two blocks 1 and 2. First pin is 2 and second pin is 3rd. Motor clock, motor con, motor operate clockwise. Then set pin two is high and set pin three is low. Now start simulate. You can see motor is rotating. Here you can see now motor is rotating in the clockwise. If you use anti-clockwise, the second pin is low and third pin is high. The motor rotates as the anti-clockwise. You can also make a code like go to the control block and take a wait one second and duplicate it and change the connection. Second pin is high and third pin is low. One second is motor rotate clockwise and one second motor rotate anti-clockwise. You can see clockwise and anti-clockwise rotating. RPM is 143 RPM.
you can also increase the delay second pin second two delay two second delay and motor will operate two second if you connect to the motor to the arduino you can use the driver if you not use the driver then arduino pin will be damaged now you can see the check code click on the block block plus check this is a check code now again you have to start simulate if you have any problem you can comment also thank you all friends